Okay, so today we're gonna start talking about the art element forms. So what is a form? Well, it's basically a shape in three dimensions. It has length, width, height, volume. Okay, this is a cylinder. This is a sphere. Now, if you look at both of them from the top and flatten them out, you would see circles. Some of our other forms. What shape do you see here? It's a square. But this is a cube which has six sides, all of which are square. Okay, we've got a triangular prism. So some sides you would see a triangle. Some sides of this you see a rectangle. This is a cone. From one side looking at it, you see a circle. From other sides, you see a triangle. Here's another cylinder, a little bit skinnier of one. Mm -hmm. We have a rectangular prism here. So you see a rectangle from some sides. Other sides, you see Yes, that's right, a square. All right, so those are some of our forms. We are gonna learn how to make some today. So um, everybody should have gotten uh, little pads of modeling clay in your kit along with some toothpicks. So what we are going to do is we are going to make some forms out of the toothpicks and the modeling clay. So you just need to pinch off little pieces here. And these are going to, we're going to start making the sides. So first one we're going to make, we are going to make a pyramid. So first thing you do you need three sides, like you're making a triangle. And just push them into the clay. All right. Next up, we need to do the sides of that triangle. So we put there and I'm just gonna get one more little piece of clay and I'm gonna bring those toothpicks to meet there. And I have made a pyramid which is a three-dimensional form okay next one we are going to make a cube. So I need a bunch of little balls of the modeling clay. So first thing I want to do, um, I am going to make a cube. So first thing we're going to do is make a square. Place one toothpick standing 
everything straight up in each one of those. And then I'm gonna add all the clay on top. Just going to add a toothpick. Connecting each one of these sides before it falls apart. Ugh. dimensional cube. with a triangle we're gonna do a different uh, slightly different than the pyramid we're gonna do a triangular prism okay now this time we're gonna go straight up much like the cube okay and then I'm gonna put little balls on top. I find it helps to really press those base ones in to your work surface. prism. Or it looks like that. Okay. Okay. So there are three different forms that you can try and make. I want you to build a structure using your imagination and using forms. Now, uh, forms that you might find around your house, such as building blocks, those would be perfect. Um, you can also find forms that are everyday objects, like your glue stick is a cylinder. Um, here's another cylinder. Um, other things you could find, boxes, uh, soup cans, uh, anything in your house that is a shape that has length, width, height, and volume, okay? And 
use your imagination, build a structure, some sort of building with them and have fun with it.